starting the week after a long weekend I am going to tidy up in every area in our home less stuff equals less tidy up and less tidy up leads to less cleaning When I was decluttering my home, my goal was to achieve a home where we feel comfortable doing things, enjoying hobbies, yet I wanted to have a stress-free home where the stuff doesn't take over my sanity. A nice surprise in the morning I forgot I did a project What do you think? You don't like it? It's warm, it's orange. Have you seen the door? Are you crying or laughing? I'm not that colorful person. <laughs> This is actually the whole reason why I started this project. I got some magnetic organizers that I can put on the garage door so as we're living we can have things handy but I thought it would be too boring to have a white on white so that's why I decided to paint it. When I tidy up, it's all about making decisions. That's what makes it hard, the process. If things have a place where they belong, no decisions need to be made. If I have a hard time to keep up with my home and with the stuff, I have items that are lingering around without having a designated home. One of the issues that I had in this bathroom to keep somewhat more tidy is to find a way to keep the towels on the hooks. I bought these metal clippers from Amazon and the way they are designed that I can actually use them as a hook. It's secured so well this way that even when we dry our hands in a hurry, it stays on its place.
There is a life I lead in the city Hurry in to cut my teeth I can take what I need to get by It doesn't make it easy The other piece of my heart I'm so low Somewhere in the great unknown When I return from the afterglow Will you carry me like I am whole again? Wait, hold on Put me together, take me back where I belong I want it all I had a feeling that the things I found Hold on Put me together, take me back where I belong I want it all Living room and other common places, we created a boundary how much stuff we keep there. A few books, laptop or a board game is enough for us to enjoy the living room, but it's not too much to reset. For decor, I like to use just one main thing that is on the coffee table and that will represent the actual season. Keep things off of the floor that can be solved with some hooks and also the closet we created a wall-to-wall -wall shelf so that way we maximized all the space that we can have in there this table has just as much traffic as our kitchen so i am trying to keep it simple with the decor I like to decorate the shaft on the fireplace but this table I'm just trying to keep it very basic maybe a flower or a lantern but that's all since we have a high traffic here we're using it a lot for different hobbies I still have a few curtains left that I need to hem and I'm going to use the shorter one in my son's room.
there are so many things that I have to do in the garden so since the spring time I will just keep tossing all the empty <laughs> planters into the greenhouse so today I'm going to clean this up Jod got very excited at the store to see some tamale, so that's what we're going to eat for today. Some of the meat will go into the freezer and some of them will be in the refrigerator that I'm going to prepare for the rest of the week. Since I have some grocery, I'm going to go to on my pantry and tidy up a little bit. And as always, my goal is to get things off of the floor. Now that my boys are older, I like to keep all the supplements separately. So the white boxes that you can see there, each person has one with their supplements and they can take care of that for themselves. When I refill a box that has ordered items, First I empty out, I put the fresh ones on the bottom and the older ones on the top so that way I'm going to use up first the older ones.
You know how much I love my swilling bags and this is an other way to use it. So I have an opened seaweed. I don't want to take it out from there. I'm just going to put it into that swilling bag just like as is <laughs> with the bag and I'm just going to seal it. that I buy in the store are designed to bring attention to the eyes every company is in the race to get their attention of the buyers so once I bring them into my home I like to transfer them into jars they are see-through so I get to see the actual food and the actual amount because sometimes they cheat with the box they look bigger than it is <laughs> It's close from ants and other creatures and it just looks more cohesive. Say something that will make my day Cause these memories of her won't go away Haunting me so I can't sleep a basket in the pantry where I keep all the leftover nuts and just things that doesn't get eaten so I'm going to create some things with that usually I make a bar because that's the easiest if it's about sweet so I'm going to use some almonds and hazelnut dates and the main ingredients that is important in there is the cocoa butter it acts like a uh, glue it will hold that together and even on the room temperature time went by and it was her and I she promised me to never leave my side but she left me here alone I know it's dumb I still check I can't move on Whoa. Why did she go? Whoa. Was I supposed To know that she'd leave Was I too naive To think that she'd be the one Whoa. Just tell me why did she go?
thank you so much for watching until the end if you enjoy this content don't forget to like share and subscribe and i will see you soon in the next one bye